Hey guys, welcome to our channel, please click the subscribe button, and click the bell icon, and never miss another update from Almighty Java. In this video, we will see how to implement application YML in Spring Boot, YAML, yet another markup language. YAML is a superset of JSON, and as such is a very convenient format for specifying hierarchical configuration data. YAML is more readable and it is good for the developers to read slash write configuration files. YAML is a human-friendly data serialization standard for all programming languages. Benefits of YAML YAML is easily readable by humans. YAML data is portable between programming languages. YAML matches the native data structures of agile languages. YAML has a consistent model to support generic tools. YAML supports one-pass processing. YAML is expressive and extensible. YAML is easy to implement and use, just to make sure everything is working fine or not, so let's log in. See logged in successfully. Before adding YAML changes let's add some other changes related to Spring 2, as you can see it's showing some warnings in the project. So one in local config class. As you can see web MVC configurer adapter class is deprecated now, so instead of that, we can use web MVC configurer interface. See now warning gone. Some warnings in implementation package also, let's open all classes. As you can see page request related warning, now no need to create a page request object. Spring 2 created a method called event page request class. As you can see three types of of methods available. See now warning gone, add similar changes in other classes also. See now all warnings are gone. Server restarted. Let's quick test. Levels are coming, means locale is working. See pagination also working fine. Let's log out. Stop the server. Close all the open classes. Create a new file called application YML. File created, along with open application properties also. Now let's convert all properties. It's very very simple, as you can see it's automatically following the structure. It's similar to JSON without curly braces. As I said it's very simple, so just watch. Application YML is very helpful when we use profiles that we will see in the next video. See it's done. Now no need of properties file, so let's delete this. Let's start the server and see everything is working fine or not. Server started without any error, let's check the application.
See it's working. We converted properties file to YML file. I hope you also agree that it's very simple. I checked in my changes. Open our GitHub page. Changes you can find under Almighty Java 2.0. See here are the changes. That's it for this video. Please like and share this video. Subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching.